guys, it's me, and today is Thursday. I will post this on Friday, so happy Friday. Dang, I just had to run downstairs and get this. The only makeup product that I, I did not even buy this this week. I actually bought it, I got it probably last week and I forgot to show it to you, but I have just been using it this week. That's probably why I didn't show it, because I had not used it, but it is the Chanel Ombre Eyeshadow Liner Coal in Contour Graphite. If you watch Andrea Ali, she used this for that kind of like rocker chick look that she did. When I first got it, I thought, why did I get that? I know I'm not going to do that look. I don't think I look good with just makeup all around my eyes. Like, I don't mind doing it every once in a while. Like, I did like that Victoria Beckham navy blue black type pencil. But I have enjoyed this. I've been doing my wing with this. And then just going over right at the base with my, either the Valentino, yeah, the Valentino liner. I might use just the pencil end or I might use the pencil end and the marker end. Love it. So that is one thing that I wanted to show you. Then before I forget, Miranda Fry contacted me yesterday and said that she would like to give my viewers an extra discount that will start right now at five o'clock on Friday and go through the weekend. So typically my discount is 10%, but for the weekend, she is gonna offer a 15% discount. I will put the code down below. So I got out some of my favorite Miranda Fry things to show you. You guys have seen this combo. I feel like I just wore it so much you were probably sick of it. But this is, there's just something about all of this. You have to have the two bracelets, these stacking rings, and then that ring. I just feel like they all go together and they just make a really pretty look. It just looks like it's not too much, but it looks like something. I wanted to, my all-time favorite, these are like not only my all-time favorite Miranda Fry item, these are some of my all-time favorite earrings, period. And that is these. I've shown them to you before. I have worn them many times. I thought about wearing them today, but I thought it might just be a little much. So I didn't put any earrings in. Oh my goodness. Okay, I guess it doesn't really matter because my hair's down. These are just, I love how they're like a combination of glamorous plus cool. Like I would wear this with a black dress. I would wear these with a sweatshirt and leggings because they're edgy but yet pretty, and I love how they're like a combination of wings and a heart. Another thing I like about them is they kind of, when you wear them, they kind of tilt back, and it just is neat looking. So those are my favorites, and then these two chains. This one, I don't know the name, but it is a big fat rope chain that just gives a lot of look and the prices are good. It's especially when you're wanting to try something like the midi rings or just any little like a trend. It's good to just get something like this and see if you really like it. Then you could always invest more. This is the Julia chain. And this is a really nice chain because it gives the look of the rope, but it's flat. So it really is comfortable to wear. I just like, you know, just did my closets and I need to redo my jewelry. I want to get my trays. I really like just having each like designer in one tray. And when I moved, I in the rental house and when we moved, I got into a bad habit of just taking off what I was wearing and putting it with anything, and so my jewelry is kind of mixed up right now. But anyway, those are some of my favorites, these, and then there's also a bracelet that I have that looks like the Cartier bracelet that is one of their best sellers, and it sells out all the time, and she said they still had that back in stock. So thank you to Miranda Fry for offering us a better discount, and I will put all the information down below. Okay, I'm gonna show you my favorite thing next which is this bodysuit along with some other ones that I ordered. <laughs> and this is kind of a funny story. Oh, let me go silence my computer. Hold on. Anyway, when 
I moved to from our old house to that rental house, I came across a bodysuit that I had ordered a long time ago. It was one I ordered it off of Instagram. It was one of those things, the best bodysuit, rated number one. I mean, it's one of those things that you know. I did. I just saw it and I thought, gosh, this would probably be good for me to you know, wear and then tell my subscribers about. A lot of times I like to try things that have like, I don't know, you know what I mean, have a lot of hype and so we can see if it's really worth it. I never wore it while I was there and then I remember coming across it over and over again in my closet at the rental house and I just never, I don't know, it just, it's, it's a black one. And I've worn it a few times on camera. I think this black is drowning everything out. But anyway, so it's this one. And they do come with pads, but I take the pads out, but you could very easily wear the pads. So when we moved here, I came across it again, and I, for some reason in my head, I thought it was the Skims bodysuit. So I thought, let me get out that Skims bodysuit and wear it or whatever, because I'm kind of getting tired of the Zara and the Amazon bodysuits. Anyway, I realized it was this brand, and I remembered why I ordered it and everything. It's the NYX, and I love this so much. You guys know I've always loved shapewear. I just think it's, I love it more now than I used to when I felt like I needed it, but I love, I just love shapewear, and I think that's another reason I like the Skims and like Kim Kardashian style is I love how she kind of took shapewear loungewear and just your actually you know your clothing and kind of morphed it into one and that's how this is so i wore that one so much that i ended up going on the website and i ordered another black one i ordered this like pink one and then i ordered this was like a limited edition color i love it it's like a lavender type color, dusty lavender. So they're all beautiful colors. And then I got this one. And let me go ahead and move the chair here. And I wanna tell you exactly why I love it so much. It is a true bodysuit. And a true undergarment is what I'm trying to say. Right here is like a bra. Matter of fact, when you put it on, don't put it over your head, step into it, and you will, I mean, this part will have a little, you know, resistance going over your hips, at least on mine. And you pull it up, and it is the best bra. And then the straps are adjustable, and it doesn't really have a lot of, like, suck in. You know, it's just the normal. Plus, I get the medium, because I don't want it to be too tight. And then um, the snaps are, when you first see the snaps, oh, I can show you right here. When you first see them, you're going to think, oh, no, uh-uh. And it does have, like, I mean, it's meant to wear, I wear my, still wear, like, thong underwear with it, but it's meant to wear just as your bra and underwear. So it does have that, but it has these kind of snaps. And at first I thought, oh, my goodness, I'm never going to be able to get that done, but they're easy. And a lot of times I use, like, the last one anyway and it's one of those things that once you get one of them they all just you know like snap right into place love these i feel like these are the star of the week they've been the star of my you know i hate to say wardrobe but they've been the star of what i like to wear lately i love wearing them with jeans i think they were going to look so good like even with your dress pants and a blazer over it and this particular print, which is a limited edition, I just took my phone away, but I'll put it in here. All of these kind of reminded me of one of my favorite pictures of Karen Mulder. I think she was at like the MTV Movie Awards or something, and she had on something like this. And so that reminded me of that. And then this print reminded me of the Dolce & Gabbana dress that Carrie wore in Sex and the City. I think it's when she fell on stage. I'm not sure. The whole memory may be something else, but in my mind, that's what it reminded me of. Love those. So excited to have them. Couldn't wait to wear them. And then another thing I ordered was that black Skims t-shirt that I had on in my skincare video yesterday. This is, or this has been, 
my favorite bra for the past couple of weeks. It's the Skims Fits Everybody or something bra. It's the medium. I love it. I feel like it gives good support, good separation, and it's comfortable and I can sleep in it. I've got it in the nude and I've got it in black and I got another black because I got to the point where I didn't even want to wash it because I wanted to keep wearing it. Another thing I wanted to say about the bodysuit is you guys know I don't like pushed up cleavagey boobs. I like good, flowing, bouncing, soft, natural boobs. And I feel like even if you have implants like I do, which that's about all I've got left, let me tell you, I feel like it gives good cleavage. Like it's like even, you know what I mean? They're not just pushed up like that. They're just normal and I just love it. So anyway, enough about the bodysuit. Okay, this is something Instagram got me again. Instagram got me a couple times here. And I don't even, I'm not even someone who spends time scrolling. That's another thing I don't do anymore. When I talked about things I don't put in my head. But I think I, a lot of times when I just go on it, I might scroll just a little bit. And the ads, they're smart. They know what to put right in front of you. Anyway, I ordered two of these Alo Yoga pants. First pair, I tried these on today with this bodysuit. It was just too, like this was too tight and these were too tight at the top to have the look that I wanted. But these are the Airtech Zip It Flare Legging, legs for days. So they are fitted, you just pull them on. They're thick, almost like a neoprene, and they flare out at the bottom. They do have a low written right there, and then they have a zipper on the inside. So you can kind of undo the zipper and wear these with boots or heels or your tennis shoes. But I just think they're neat. And you guys know I love to mix like athletic wear. Like I would so wear this with a moto jacket or a faux fur or a big hoodie sweatshirt with heels. I mean, I like to mix it up. I just think that's what makes an outfit interesting. So I'm always looking for, you know, athletic pants that kind of are elevated a little bit. Okay, here is another pair I ordered. These are not as nice of a material. You can see these are just much blacker. These are more of a suede. They also say Alo right back there. But these have the zipper in the front kind of like the Norma Kamali spat leggings. And I thought I would like these too. These I think would really look good with some kind of cool tennis shoes. Airbrush, that's why it's that fabric right there. They're calling it airbrush, high waist, flutter, legging, bell bottoms with the cool seam. So my my intentions are probably going to be to wear those with, like, I love the look of that gray Anina Bing hoodie with those and, like, my Jimmy Choo pointed slingbacks or a ankle boot with a pointed heel, something like that. Another good thing I have to share with you is, you guys know I have followed Shalice Noel on Instagram forever. Some of my oldest outfit inspirations are from her, and she always wears this really cool poncho. If you follow her, you, you know what I'm talking about, and I realized it was hers. She is selling it. So I bought one, and she wrote a nice little letter on the thing, so I messaged her to see if she wanted to give us a discount code, and she did. So I'll put it down below. It's 10% off. These are available in regular one size and then the petite. So it would be, I, I would think, shorter. But they come also come in um, a bone color. I'm not sure, there's another color too, it might be gray. But, I mean, she wears them with shorts, biker shorts, everything, and it is just really cool. It's got a really cool drape to it, like that's the neck, and then it drapes over like that, and then see how this is split so high. So it's not a poncho that's going to look um, like you're wrapped up in a blanket. It really has a nice flow. Kind of, as you can see, kind of gearing up for fall weather. 
This, like another reason a good bodysuit would go well with any outfit, but this over your leggings or skinny jeans, or skinny jeans, or I think skinny jeans will always be in. I don't know if the skinny jeans are going out. Or, you know, just anything. Just shorts, biker shorts, jean shorts. You can wear it with anything. So I will put that down below. And then I got a nice package from Skylar. Remember when I talked about these scents a few weeks ago, they sent me the best package with a sleep mask. It is so cute. Brooke, really every night sleeps with this. And it is so cute when you go in there and she's sleeping because you moms know, it does not matter how old they get. When you look at your children sleeping, you cannot help but think of them, how they looked when they were babies sleeping. Just are some of my best memories is rocking your baby with the bottle and the way they look at you the whole time and they mess with your face and then when you put them on your shoulder, just the way they melt onto your body. And we had that old, remember John's old green leather recliner that rocked. And um, I had a, a song that I would sing and I would not want to put them down. I would have so much, especially when Will was little, I was sewing a lot and I had a business and I had things I had to do, but I always, you know, they come first. So I would feed him his like night night bottle and then he would be on my shoulder and I would have so much to do but I could not quit rocking him it just felt so good so anyway of course you know it's clean fragrances I feel like I've told you all that so much before clean crisp nature inspired scents with a conscience hyperallergenic safe for sensitive skin cruelty free vegan eco-friendly and sustainable and lots of good fragrances and they sent me this sweatshirt and I saw that it was on their website. Very cool. I love that it's cropped and it's wide like that. I will definitely, and it's nice. It's not like a bobo sweatshirt. I can just tell it's really nice. So thank you to Skylar for sending these to me too. Okay, I'm going to put some of these things up and then I'm going to show you two pairs of boots. I think I have... No, I don't have any more coming. I think it's something I was thinking about ordering. And I thought, well, maybe I should wait and do a boot video, but I can't wait. I'm going to go ahead and show them to you. Especially because one's from Zara, and you need to go ahead and get them if they're still available. Okay, these are the ones from Zara. And I love, you guys know, I love boots. I love boots. And every year, it seems like I get into kind of a little bit of a different look. So a lot of my boots I ended up just selling at the resale store. So I don't have that many left. My Schutz boots are always just part of my favorites. Matter of fact, the black ones are the ones I'm thinking about ordering. But this year I thought I want some good cowboy boots. I want some good cowboy boots that I love that look of like cowboy boots with leggings and a big sweatshirt or a big, I don't know, a blazer. Not, not like a dressy blazer, unless the boots were dressy, but, or a faux fur. Just, I love, I've always loved cowboy boots. So I ended up getting these from Zara. I think they're pretty amazing. I love the color and I love the detail work. I did see Shalice wearing a pair of, I believe they're Vince Camuto, that are in this same light color and they look real similar, but they're not quite as cowboy looking and they don't have the stitching. So I will link those down below too. I thought about getting them and I was like, no, I really like these and I don't need two pair that would do this. And then these are my splurge of the week. These are YSL and they are divine. They are just everything you could want in an ankle cowboy boot. I feel like they're very Kate Moss, just classic, something that will look good forever. And I had mentioned to Barbara that works at, she used to work at Bergdorf, now she's at Saks, that I was, this was a month or more ago, that I wanted some good cowboy boots. And so when they got these in, she sent me a picture and I just love them. So that, those are special. Okay, and that is it. So I'm going to show you a quick outfit of the day and then let you go enjoy your weekend. Again, with the jeans, I know I tried on, 
let's see, one, two, three pairs of black pants to go with this. And they all looked okay, but when I put these on, these bomb pop jeans from AYR, these I felt looked the best. And they're just so comfortable, so comfortable. So along with being comfortable, I decided to put on these mules. I showed you the nude ones last week. I got the black ones, I think, that day, and I love them. They're just good throw-on black shoes. Hmm, now that I'm looking at this, I might end up putting on either the, I don't like the way that this looks with the pants. So I may put on either the Colt Gaia, that was my first choice, or the Jimmy Choo. But I'm glad you're getting to see these shoes anyway. I need something to hold on to so that you can get them if you want a comfortable black shoe. Uh, my nails, OPI Bubble Bath, and I did order some new nails. It was a company I had never heard of, but Sam Sherman had them on her Instagram, and then one of my followers sent me the picture. So I placed an order of some really cool nails that maybe we'll try. It's, I can't even remember what brand it was. So lots of exciting things coming up. So I hope you'll stick with me. I hope that you will subscribe to my channel. Please give this video a like and I will see you, if not this weekend, I'll see you on Monday. Bye-bye.